Yo, what's good everybody? This is your boy Boss Golf. Welcome back to Boss Golf Plays. Yo, we've been talking about DBZ games. Or I guess I talked about DBZ in a in a previous video, but uh I wanted to talk about something that I found <laughs> actually to be pretty damn interesting. If y'all haven't heard of it yet or checked it out, go look up Dragon Ball Fusions. It is a nifty little RPG game that unfortunately at least for right now, I think it's only being released in Japan. But yo, I looked at this shit and I said, this is probably something I've always wanted to see in a Dragon Ball Z game. It's basically uh, the storyline from what I've read is your uh, default character or whatever uh, gathers Shinron or collects Shinron and wants to fight the strongest warriors in the universe or something. So you're you your character i think your character's friends or whatever get put in this universe where there's this big ass tournament with all these dragon ball z characters and you can link up with other people online link up with characters i mean go and do do the whole rpg shit. i don't know if it has an actual storyline to it other than then just battling in the tournament but i i thought the most interesting part about it was the fact that you confuse dbz characters together that you pretty much always wanted to fuse together honestly i think this is like a fan service game because i mean they even had uh i seen cell and freezer fuse together <laughs> boo and hercule and uh i think on the wikipedia page or the dragon ball wiki page whatever whichever one i looked at they got it to where you can uh they, there's a set amount of characters that you can fuse so far. I don't know if this is just temporary or anything like that. But, I mean, the fact of the matter is you can fuse characters together. And some of them are characters that people wanted to fuse for a long time. I, I, I don't know. Maybe you could fuse any character with any pair. But I think, I just thought it was pretty damn interesting that these characters, I mean, <laughs> it's a fusion game. Yeah, like, I was sitting there thinking the other day, I was like, this is so damn interesting. If I were to get a 3DS, because I don't have one, I don't plan on getting one either. If honestly, the only reason I would probably want a 3DS would be to play this game. But unfortunately, like I said, it's only for right now, or at least as far as I know, it's only coming out in Japan. So, not much you can do about that in that aspect, unless somebody has like a 3DS emulator and you try to play it on your PC or whatever. But I just thought this shit was interesting. Y'all should let me know what y'all think about it, because I was sitting there thinking the other day, I was like, yo, what if they had a Dragon Ball Z game that wasn't just the RPG, that was a, a like, a game like Xeno, because you can customize in this shit too. So not only can you fuse characters together, you can customize your characters and all this other shit. I was thinking, like, what would they do if you had a game like Xenoverse? Yo, <laughs> fuck that. You know what they need to do? They need to fuse this game. They need to fuse Xenoverse, the uh, Budokai series, and the Tenkaichi games all in one fucking game. You do that, oh my goodness, the perfect Dragon Ball Z game. I'm, I'm dead ass serious, but... I just want to talk about this game. I thought it was fucking nifty. They even got, they even showed you can fuse five characters together. And so far, the only five characters that you can fuse together is uh, pretty much the main characters from the Dragon Ball GT series. That's Pan, Goku, Trunks. Um, who else? It was Pan, Goku, Trunks. I think your created character, and maybe. Gohan? I don't I don't remember. I don't know. But it's some some big ass fusion character. This look boss as shit. I was like, God damn, that's gonna be <laughs> hey, that's what's up. But let me know what y'all think about Dragon Ball Fusions. I mean, does it look like something you'll play? I I know for sure, damn sure I play it. And I actually like RPGs, so that's right down my alley. That's right up my street. So that'd be that definitely be something I'd look into. But I just want to talk about that real quick. This is a nifty little game, little chibi game, cute ass characters. And I, I was like, damn, yo, this is uh this is interesting. But y'all know me about the DBZ games lately. I already talked about that. But let me know your thoughts in the comment box. Would you play this damn game? Would you buy it? Would you recommend it? I like I said, I don't actually speaking of fusing games together, how would that work? Cause like in Xenoverse, it's it's an M, pretty much an MMO. And like if you and another, cause in Dragon Ball Fusions, you can you and another person's created character can fuse together. So how would that work? Would you just take over that character? I don't know, man. That, that's something to talk about. Like if you and another person online fuse together, how would that gameplay go? Hey, that'd be pretty interesting to see how that would work out. Like 
if you and another character fuse together, you got one person that controls the the movement of the character, the other person controls like the actions and shit. I don't know, that'd be pretty interesting. I'd actually, I I don't know if I'd pay to see that shit, but I'd like to see how that work out. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. Just want to talk about that. Uh, I'm out of this bitch, man. I, I'll see you silly hoes on the flip one. Peace. Yeah.